Many organizations around Jefferson County were taken by surprise after receiving heartbreaking news of an electric company's tax mistake that would now cost them thousands of dollars most just don't have. This has been a roller coaster of a week, um, I think, for our board, for our staff team, certainly. Um, we've been really, we've tried to be transparent with our team that we might be seeing a number of layoffs of staff. I can cut either staff hours or library hours, and I can, or I can cut programs and materials. Both the Madras Aquatic Center and Jefferson County Library were among several organizations impacted by a mistake through Portland General Electric due to an accounting mistake at the Round Butte Hydroelectric plant. For us, that means $156,000 less last year, plus the impacts of that going into this current fiscal year. And so when you add all of it together, plus a $65,000 shortfall that we already knew we had, we're a shortfall of about $351,000. In all, PGE overpaid the county nearly $2 million in tax refunds. For the library, that portion is $110,000. As far as I know, we need to, to reimburse the 55 from last year, and I need to cut this year because my budget obviously is more than my income. So that, that's really the, the hurt. Everything from the school district to the jail to the Madges Aquatic Center have been saddled with a payback amount. The two most viable options are one, offering Madras High School swim season and tackle football this fall, and other than that, not offering any other programs and services. And then the fourth option um, is not offering any services aside from tackle football. The Madras Aquatic Center board is meeting Wednesday to discuss its options. Steelhaugen, Central Oregon Daily News.